Welcome back. This is uh, footage from the 10 year anniversary. Um, I was at, I think it was Do Dixie, when uh, all these fireworks were going off, which I thought was pretty cool. And I decided to put uh, this, and um, I'm going to insert some footage from the uh, from a mining op because I want some festivity and fun before I talk about a serious topic, um, and that's industrialism come Odyssey. So. Uh, because with the changes happening, um, yeah, I don't know how that's going to impact the game. But first, uh, some fun with the corp. His bow is going to touch my engines. It's very bad. <laughs> Show us where he touched you. Manual uh, cargo transfer. I am so recording this. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Keep my mouth shut. <laughs> yeah, everybody shut up. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> Thanks oh, for warning. <laughs> God. I always think I sound stupid. I'm yeah, using no, com no comments from anybody else. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> now wait till you see this on video. It's uh thing at the bottom. Well, yeah, but you can't get an exact speed, can you? No. I wish there was a way to enter a number and say go at this speed. Then you could really get fleets while well, well, moving at the same speed. If you do, keep it ranged current and it should match the speed. Look at this formation. <laughs> Orca, lead the charge. I was mining in a uh, high sec location, and this guy that I noticed has been in his pod sitting here for about 20 minutes, 30 minutes now. And I thought that this would be the perfect segue to what I'm about to talk about because I totally understand the distaste for people that AFK mine. Totally get it, and this is a perfect example of it. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, sometimes things come up. Something comes up with your kid, or you know, something business related or something like that. You're gonna pick up and go, you're gonna deal with it, and whatever is happens, happens while you're gone. Um, but uh, I can see the argument that a high sec is a little too safe if you're able to sit in a pod for a half hour that I know of. I have no idea how long this person was there in total. Um, and nothing happened to you. Oh, so I get that. I totally get that. But what I want to talk about, and this is Sissy, um, I, I, I want to see the new animation because I think it's I think it's hot is industrialism come Odyssey hold on does this not look like Terra it's Terra baby so anyway um oh wait 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 oh. God I love that so anyway um what I've been experiencing and what people have been telling me is that there has been an increase in ganking. Now let me be clear on what I term PvP. PvP is player versus player where two people fight each other. Sorry, I had to fix my mic there a second. Okay, where two people fight each other. Ganking is when the per one person is either ganged up ganged up on 
is when one person is is injected into a PvP situation and they have no chance of winning because they're either ganged up on or in Eve's case you're in a ship that has no guns there's no and it's not that the player screwed up and didn't fit any guns it's that the ship doesn't have a place to do the purpose that the ship is for and have guns so with mining with the security changes coming up in odyssey it's going to be much much easier for people to gank and what my question is is what ship do you use to mine because it is unrealistic to think that everybody's going that wants to to, to make ships and make things in the game is going to do it in a group that's stupid to think that because you can't get enough people even with your largest corpse with people located all over the world getting enough people who want to do the same thing that you want to do at the same time that you want to do it in the same area that you want to do it in you know uh, that's that's why people get burnt out and wow um, you'll hear about raiders they raid real hard and then they're just like worn out because they've 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 burnt themselves out so when your gameplay is dependent on other people all the time to do the principal thing that you want to do then that game stops being fun and it stops being you, you start looking around to see what your other options are what I want to know and the purpose of this video is if you want to mine the ore because you want to make something and I'm not talking about F AFK miners because I don't AFK mine um, but if you want to create things in the game make your own ships make your own ammo make your own modules um, how what ship do you use now don't tell me well if you want a solo mine you use a Mac Macs don't have guns and as it is right now if you want a solo mine which is a solo activity now you you need to you need guns and to my understanding none of the ore barges the mining ships allow you to fit a gun they're or they're 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 the reason that they're there is for or benefits not defense benefits and that's what I don't that's where my brain sort of cluster fucks in this game if this is a world PvP game and every world in any world PvP game that I've been in previous that's well very spiky wow that's spontaneous um before this oh I'm seeing yes on them yeah yeah, they do that. They they announce when people come on. It's kind of cute. Anyway, um, in, in a world PvP game, every other game that I've been in, you always have your weapons. You always have your gear. Okay? Always. When you step outside. Now, if you decide to put, you know, on some, some civilian clothes or whatever, um, yeah. But the odds of you stepping outside the city with that shit you don't do that now that doesn't mean that because you have your gears and your guns or your swords or whatever that you're going to win but you have a way to defend yourself and in eve in a world pvp game they actually have ships where you're defenseless that makes absolutely no sense to me I, I, it, the, my brain at the, of a game that's 10 years old I think honestly that when people were using regular ships and were expanding the cargo holds that was better than what we have now because what we have now has been in my opinion a systematical sneaky fucking way to make miners defenseless with the lure of the large cargo holds so that's why I'm making this video I want to understand 
like I said, well, six months ago, I saw a mackerel mining. And I laughed my uh, my ass off, and I, you know, I was like, oh, my God. It pained me a little bit because you know, y'all know that's my favorite ship. But now, why not? You have a tank. You have drones. You have guns. Now, you don't have the best mining yields, but you'll survive. And you'll very likely take out you know, people if they decide to gang up on you. So, um, yeah, that's what I want to know. What is Come Odyssey, the mining ship? And do not t name me a ship that doesn't have guns. It's got to be a ship fitted for with guns. Because without guns, you're just a pinata waiting to be shot. And um, I don't see the appeal in that. I, I, I just don't, I don't see the appeal. When I want a PvP, I want a PvP. There, there's, there's, it takes, a, to me, a very weak person to um, gang up on someone. Like, when I was on a PvP server, I didn't gang people because I didn't get any pleasure in that. That's a... a Oh, a, a win situation. I can't lose. Talking so why? I, I, don't, I don't get why people. That's why I said it takes a very weak personality. There's something. Yeah, I don't get it. So tell me, which ship do you use to mine with guns? And I'll see you guys in the next one.